Hello fellow followers and welcome to Fan Scene and today I have for you a little review on the Vinegar Syndrome Blu-ray release of Fade to Black and on Fade to Black the movie itself. Are you an actress? No. It's amazing. You look exactly like me. We know, we know. Everybody says that. What was the name of the movie that Tom Yule took you to see in Seven Year Itch? Who the hell cares? It was a creature from the Black Lagoon. Hey, how did you know that? It's great. I go to a lot of movies. It's my thing. Fade to Black was made in 1980, and it was written and directed by Vernon Zimmerman, and it starred Dennis Christopher, Linda Carriage, and had an appearance by legendary actor Mickey Rourke himself. Now, this movie is considered a slasher film, but I think it is so much more than a slasher film. I think it is a brilliant movie, and for anybody who's a fan of movies and is a cinephile and, like, even old Hollywood and, like, 80s movies, this movie is just... Uh, great. It's a great, great flick. Dennis Christopher stars as Eric Benford, who is absolutely obsessed with, like, Hollywood, Hollywood memorabilia, old films from the past, and just, he spends all of his money and his time on on these things, and he lives with his, uh, what he thinks at the time is his aunt, and who is basically verbally ab abusive. He works at a 35 millimeter print uh, factory, um, and he gets basically bullied there too by Mickey Rourke and the likes and he meets this woman who he, uh, he thinks looks like Marilyn Monroe a lot of people do she's like an aspiring actress from Australia and uh, he's he slowly begins to go insane in this movie uh, uh, unable to determine what's real and what's not real because he's so obsessed with these movies and what's going on in his life and he, he basically loses it and uh, he starts killing people dressed as his favorite movie characters and it's just absolutely uh, a, a great film just that just goes far and beyond uh, your typical uh, slasher film. I wish you'd eat your breakfast the way you devour those things. Brain food is what you need, not escape this trash. Dennis Christopher gives an amazing performance in this movie. Uh, just brilliant, just brilliant all around. Uh, Vernon Zimmerman uh, crafted a, a pretty special movie here, in my opinion, uh, filled with great performances, great cinematography, and just a, a like a, hu a great character study on somebody who can become so obsessed with film and memorabilia, which a lot of us, you know, out there, we tend to do. I, I guess I could say I'm a little guilty of obsessing over uh, movies, but I, 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 I'm sane, <laughs> as far as I believe. Uh, but this movie just, you know, is just genius as far as I'm concerned. And if I had to relate this movie to a modern movie for people out there who say, uh, you know, why would I watch this movie? With, uh, well, if you've seen the movie Joker, Joker is very similar to this, but this is still its own thing. I don't really like to compare, but for those out there who are wondering, if, you've li if you like the Joker, you probably would like this movie. But this movie, uh, I think, was way ahead of its time. It's kind of like the flip side to Joker. Like, Joker was New York, this guy bullied, and this is uh, Hollywood, and he's bullied, and it's just... I don't know how to, how to explain it, but they are similar, but very different movies, uh, but in the same vein. Uh, you should check this out. It's really great. And as for the Vinegar Syndrome release of the Blu-ray, which this is its very first release on Blu-ray, uh, it's great. It's been newly scanned and restored in 4K from a 35mm print of the film. It's, it's just brilliant. It's region-free Blu-ray, so you can play it in all countries. Uh, you get this cover here, you know. And on the inside here, there's the Blu-ray, but you get the reversible cover, which is always amazing. I love when they do that. And there's a couple different versions of this. When I ordered this, I actually uh, just ordered the this plain one, which is it's fine. I love it. Don't get me wrong. But you can also get two slipcover versions, one with this uh, on here. This is front. This is back. Uh, and then you can get one like this with the nuclear commission artwork and here's here's this front and here's its back uh, You know the most and they're actually on sale right now on vinegar syndrome.com for Valentine's Day if you want to go uh, Check that out and buy those there's amazing Not, nothing wrong with the plain copy It's fine, but I kind of wish I would have got the slip cover But other than that it's great and this is loaded with special features uh, Commentary track with Dennis Christopher, which is great. Uh, commentary track with uh, the hysteria continues. Commentary track with uh, film historians Amanda Reyes and Bill Ackerman. Interview with uh, Dennis Christopher and Linda Carriage, and just so much more. Just in the original trailer, just just brilliant. Vinegar Syndrome does great work on movies like this, and uh, if you if you want, you should really add this to your collection because it's a great movie. This is a great uh, Blu-ray. Shout out to Vinegar Syndrome for finally putting this out there, and. Uh, you know, do yourself a favor, 
check this movie out. And in the comment section down below, leave me some thoughts on this review. And if you've seen uh, Fade to Black, and let me know what you think about it, because I really want to know what you guys think about this. And if you like this video, please give it a like. If you did not like this video, you can go ahead and give it a dislike. That is up to you guys. No hurt feelings here. Share the video out for everybody to see. Uh, please subscribe and hit that bell for notifications. I would truly appreciate it. Wherever you are, have a great, safe, happy, healthy day, morning, afternoon, evening, and night. Thank you for watching. Godspeed.